Passion Travel is a channel specializing in all things travel street food and subscribe. Tamales. Costa Rican tamales are typically made with masa, corn dough, filled with a mixture of meat, vegetables, and spices, wrapped in banana leaves, and steamed. Tamales are a beloved traditional dish in Costa Rica, as well as in many other Latin American countries. Costa Rican tamales, known as tamales ticos, have their own unique preparation and flavor. Here's a basic recipe for making Costa Rican tamales. Ingredients. For the filling. 2 cups cooked shredded chicken or pork, seasoned with salt and pepper. 2 cups cooked rice. 1 cup cooked black beans, drained. 1 half cup diced red bell pepper. 1 half cup diced green bell pepper. 1 half cup diced carrots. 1 quarter cup green peas. 1 quarter cup diced onion. 2 cloves garlic, minced. 1 quarter cup chopped fresh cilantro. 1 quarter cup lasano sauce, a popular Costa Rican condiment. Salt and pepper to taste. For the masa, 3 cups masa harina, corn masa flour. 2 cups chicken or vegetable broth, warm. 1 cup vegetable oil. 1 teaspoon salt. Banana leaves or parchment paper for wrapping. Instructions. Prepare the banana leaves. If you're using banana leaves, cut them into squares and lightly heat them over an open flame or in a hot oven to soften them. This makes them pliable for wrapping the tamales. If you're using parchment paper, cut it into squares. Prepare the filling. In a large skillet, heat some vegetable oil over medium heat. Add the diced onions, bell peppers, carrots, and garlic. Saute until the vegetables are tender. Add the shredded chicken or pork, cooked rice, cooked black beans, green peas, cilantro, lasano sauce, salt, and pepper. Cook for a few more minutes until everything is well combined. Remove from heat and set aside. Prepare the masa. In a large mixing bowl, combine the masa harina, warm chicken or vegetable broth, vegetable oil, and salt. Mix until you have a smooth dough-like consistency. If it's too dry, you can add a bit more warm broth. Assemble the tamales. Lay out a banana leaf square or parchment paper square on a clean surface. Place a small amount of masa in the center and flatten it into a rectangle or square. Spoon a portion of the filling mixture on top of the masa. Wrap the tamales. Carefully fold the banana leaf or parchment paper over the masa and filling to create a packet. Fold in the sides to seal the tamale. Steam the tamales. Arrange the tamales upright in a large steamer. Steam them for about 1.5 to 2 hours or until the masa is firm and no longer sticks to the leaf or paper. Ceviche. Fresh seafood, typically fish or shrimp, marinated in citrus juices and mixed with onions, cilantro, and spices. Ceviche is a popular and refreshing seafood dish enjoyed in Costa Rica, as well as many other Latin American countries. It's made by marinating raw seafood in citrus juices, typically lime or lemon, which cook the seafood by denaturing the proteins. Costa Rican ceviche often includes a mix of fish and shrimp, but variations with other seafood are also common. Here's a basic recipe for making Costa Rican ceviche. Ingredients. 1 pound fresh white fish, such as sea bass or tilapia, diced into small pieces. 1 half pound fresh shrimp, peeled, deveined, and diced. 1 cup fresh lime juice, about 8 to 10 limes. 1 half cup fresh lemon juice, about 4 to 5 lemons. 1 half cup diced red onion. 1 half cup diced bell pepper, red or green. 1 half cup diced cucumber. 1 quarter cup chopped fresh cilantro. 2 cloves garlic, minced. 1 to 2 fresh hot peppers, such as jalapenos or serranos, minced. Adjust to your preferred level of spiciness. Salt and pepper to taste. Optional toppings. Avocado slices, extra cilantro, hot sauce, or tortilla chips. Instructions. Prepare the seafood. In a large mixing bowl, combine the diced fish and shrimp. Marinate the seafood. Pour the fresh lime and lemon juice over the seafood. Make sure the seafood is completely submerged in the juice. Cover the bowl with plastic wrap and refrigerate for about 30 minutes to 1 hour. The citrus juices will cook the seafood by turning it opaque. Drain the citrus juice. After marinating, drain the citrus juice from the seafood. You can use a colander or fine mesh strainer to remove excess liquid. Add ingredients. In a clean mixing bowl, combine the marinated seafood with the diced red onion, bell pepper, cucumber, cilantro, minced garlic, and minced hot peppers. Mix well. Season. Season the ceviche with salt and pepper to taste. 
You can also adjust the spiciness by adding more minced hot peppers if desired. Chill. Cover the ceviche and return it to the refrigerator for at least 30 minutes to allow the flavors to meld. Serve. Serve Costa Rican ceviche in individual bowls or cups. You can garnish with avocado slices, extra cilantro, or a drizzle of hot sauce if you like. Ceviche is often accompanied by tortilla chips or saltines. Costa Rican ceviche is a delicious and vibrant dish that highlights the flavors of the sea and the freshness of citrus and vegetables. It's perfect as an appetizer or a light meal on a warm day. Enjoy! Chifrijo A popular snack made with a combination of white rice, black beans, diced pork or chicharron, and pico de gallo salsa. Chifrijo is a popular Costa Rican dish that's often enjoyed as a snack, appetizer, or even a meal. It's a flavorful combination of rice, beans, diced pork or chicharron, fried pork, pico de gallo salsa, and other delicious ingredients. Here's a basic recipe for making chifrijo. Ingredients For the chifrijo, 2 cups cooked white rice. 2 cups cooked black beans, you can use canned beans, drained and rinsed. 1 cup diced pork or chicharron, fried pork. 1 half cup lasano sauce, a popular Costa Rican condiment. 1 half cup diced red onion. 1 half cup diced tomatoes. 1 quarter cup chopped fresh cilantro. 2 cloves garlic, minced. 2 tablespoons vegetable oil. Salt and pepper to taste. Optional garnishes. Sliced avocado sliced jalapenos, lime wedges, tortilla chips. Instructions. Prepare the beans. If you're using canned beans, drain and rinse them. You can also cook dried black beans if you prefer. Season them with salt and pepper to taste. Prepare the pork or chicharron. If you have cooked chicharron, fried pork, dice it into small pieces. If you're using uncooked pork, you can cook it in a skillet until it's crispy and fully cooked. Remove any excess oil and set it aside. Make the pico de gallo. In a mixing bowl, combine the diced red onion, diced tomatoes, minced garlic, chopped cilantro, and a pinch of salt. Mix well to create the pico de gallo salsa. Assemble the chifrijo. In individual serving bowls or plates, start with a layer of cooked white rice. Add a layer of cooked black beans on top of the rice. Sprinkle the diced pork or chicharron over the beans. Drizzle lasano sauce over the layers. You can adjust the amount to your taste. Spoon the pico de gallo salsa over the top. Garnish and serve. Garnish the chifrijo with sliced avocado, sliced jalapenos, lime wedges, and tortilla chips if desired. Enjoy. Chifrijo is often enjoyed with friends and family as a social snack or appetizer. It's delicious, flavorful, and a great way to experience the taste of Costa Rica. Chifrijo is a delightful and savory dish that brings together the flavors of Costa Rican cuisine. It's known for its satisfying combination of textures and tastes, making it a favorite among locals and visitors alike. Tacos Ticos Costa Rican-style tacos filled with seasoned meat, cabbage, and various toppings. Tacos Ticos are a popular Costa Rican street food that puts a local twist on traditional tacos. These tacos are made with soft corn tortillas and filled with seasoned meat, typically shredded beef or chicken, and a variety of fresh toppings. Here's a basic recipe for making tacos ticos. Ingredients. For the taco filling. 1 pound shredded beef or chicken, cooked and seasoned with your choice of spices. 1 tablespoon vegetable oil. 1 half cup diced onions. 2 cloves garlic, minced. 1 teaspoon ground cumin. 1 half teaspoon paprika salt and pepper to taste. Lozano sauce or your favorite hot sauce, optional, for added flavor. For the tacos, soft corn tortillas, chopped lettuce or cabbage, diced tomatoes, diced bell peppers, red or green, sliced avocado, sliced radishes, fresh cilantro leaves, lime wedges, sour cream, shredded cheese, such as queso fresco, salsa, red or green, to taste. Instructions. Prepare the taco filling. Heat the vegetable oil in a skillet over medium-high heat. Add the diced onions and minced garlic. Sauté until the onions are translucent. Add the shredded beef or chicken to the skillet and season it with ground cumin, paprika, salt, and pepper. Cook until the meat is heated through and well-seasoned. You can also add a splash of lasano sauce or hot sauce for extra flavor. Warm the tortillas. In a dry skillet or on a griddle, warm the corn tortillas until they are soft and pliable. You can wrap them in a clean kitchen towel to keep them warm. 
Assemble the tacos. Lay out the warm tortillas on a clean surface. Place a portion of the seasoned meat in the center of each tortilla. Add toppings. Customize your tacos ticos with a variety of toppings. Common options include chopped lettuce or cabbage, diced tomatoes, diced bell peppers, sliced avocado, sliced radishes, fresh cilantro leaves, and lime wedges. Drizzle with sauce. Add a drizzle of your favorite salsa, red or green, to the tacos for extra flavor and a bit of heat. Serve. Serve tacos ticos with sour cream and shredded cheese on the side. Enjoy. Tacos ticos are typically served as handheld treats, perfect for enjoying with friends and family. Costa Rican tacos ticos are a delicious and satisfying street food that combines savory, tender meat with a medley of fresh toppings and flavors. Feel free to adjust the fillings and toppings to suit your preferences and enjoy this delightful Costa Rican twist on tacos. Coripanes. Grilled sausages, chorizos, served in a bun with chimichurri sauce and condiments. Coripanes are a popular street food dish in Costa Rica and several other Latin American countries, including Argentina and Chile. The name, choripan, is a combination of chorizo, a type of sausage, and pan, bread which essentially describes the dish. A sandwich made with grilled or roasted chorizo sausage served in a roll or baguette-style bread. Here's how to make choripanes. Ingredients. For the choripan, chorizo sausages, spicy or mild, according to your preference. Baguette-style rolls or bread of your choice. Olive oil or cooking spray, for grilling or roasting. Optional toppings. Chimichurri sauce, salsa criolla, sliced onions, sliced bell peppers. For chimichurri sauce, optional, but highly recommended. 1 half cup fresh parsley leaves, chopped. 4 cloves garlic, minced. 2 tablespoons red wine vinegar. 1 half cup olive oil. 1 teaspoon dried oregano. 1 half teaspoon red pepper flakes. Adjust to your preferred level of spiciness. Salt and pepper to taste. Instructions. For the chimichurri sauce, optional. In a mixing bowl, combine the chopped parsley, minced garlic, red wine vinegar, olive oil, dried oregano, red pepper flakes, salt, and pepper. Mix well. Let the chimichurri sauce sit for at least 15 to 20 minutes to allow the flavors to meld. For the choripan, preheat your grill or stovetop griddle over medium-high heat. You can also roast the chorizo sausages in the oven or on a stovetop pan. Brush the chorizo sausages with a bit of olive oil or use cooking spray to prevent sticking. Grill or roast the chorizo sausages until they are cooked through and have a nice char, typically about 5 to 7 minutes per side. While the sausages are cooking, slice the baguette-style rolls or bread in half lengthwise. Once the chorizo sausages are done, place them inside the sliced rolls. If desired, Top the coripanes with chimichurri sauce, sliced onions, sliced bell peppers, or other toppings of your choice. Serve the coripanes immediately. They are often enjoyed as a handheld snack or street food. Coripanes are a flavorful and satisfying street food dish that combines the smoky and spicy flavors of chorizo sausage with the freshness of the bread and optional toppings. They are a popular choice for quick, tasty meals in Costa Rica and beyond.